Round two highlights from the web.com tours news Sentinel Open presented by Pilot held at Fox Den Country Club in Knoxville, Tennessee. Starting off on the 14th, it's Jeff Gove. He was having a rough couple of days trying to bounce back from a round 176. And this will help as he spins it back to within a foot, leaving himself a nice birdie here to get to four over par. He would card an even par 71, go on to miss the cut. Andres Echevarria now on the 18th. This is his third shot, sitting at two under at this point. He began the day two over, so is looking to claw his way back into the weekend, and he would do just that with a bogey-free five under 66, including this birdie here on the 18th. That puts him inside the cut line at three under overall. The cut did settle at two under. So a very nice Friday for Andres Echevarria. John Curran now, he began on the back nine, made the turn at four under. So he's coming off a bogey here at six, looking for that bounce back birdie, giving himself about eight feet here for birdie to move it to six under par. And he drops that in. He would get one back for a four under 67, five under overall for John Curran. Ryan Spears now sitting at seven under par. This is his second shot on the ninth. He also started on the back nine, so this is his final hole of the day. He almost holes out, but leaves himself a tap-in birdie there to finish at eight under overall. He's just two off the lead. Camilo Benedetti now, the Colombian, who graduated from the University of Florida, looking for a strong day to put himself in contention heading into the weekend as he stuffs it in there on the ninth as well. Gives himself a nice birdie look here to move to nine under par, and that's where he will enter moving day. He is just one off the lead. Roger Sloan, and we'll keep it on the ninth. The Canadian already inside the top 25 right now on the money list. He's 22nd, but with a win, he would move to sixth, guaranteeing that you will see him on the PGA Tour next year. Take a look at that beautiful approach shot. This for birdie to move it to 10 under par. Tie for the lead with Martin Piller. He gets it to go. So it's Martin Piller and Roger Sloan leading the way at 10 under par after 36 holes.